Well, way up north, where it's really cold, the elves are working hard, as I am told. Christmas is coming, and the toys need testing, so there is no time for sleeping or resting. Santa sees the need and tells Rudy to fly and bring the elves just a little surprise. The present arrives, it moves to and fro, it puzzles an elf, and off she goes. With a tip of the box and happy tales, everyone's surprised about what's unveiled. The elves are as happy as can be and dance about showing their glee. The helpers are testing all toys in the shop working both day and night without a stop. Skateboards and scooters and cars galore. Oh my goodness, there are thousands more. Making sure each one rolls just right, pushing and pulling throughout the night. There's so many toys you want to share with your brothers and sisters to show that you care. All the toys will be ready for play when they arrive on Christmas Day. Oh, there's so much fun to be had for all the girls and boys who have been good and not bad. Santa is happy. The elves are all set. The present they received was the best gift yet. Playing in the snow, a snowman we will make. One should think we know, it will be really great. We'll get his nose and hat, and make him really fat. Along comes a dear poodle, and then he goes splat. Oh dear. The end. One dog, two dogs, three dogs. Now the testing is done. Alvin can choose his favorite one. Okay, Alvin. Alvin knows they're the very best kind, but he just cannot make up his mind. He checks them over carefully, then scampers off, saying, they're all for me.
Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night.